Hi there, this is Carrie with Idea Girl Media coming to you from my Facebook page the day after Facebook rolled out the timeline um, format for business pages. Now, um, I just want to go through a couple of things with you. Um, here, you want to make sure that you've got a brief bulleted um, description of your company with a clickable link to your website that's very important. Um, then you also want to um, note that your most recent photos will be here. Your most important thumbnail tab should be here and then you have four tabs across to help share the story of your brand. Um, with Facebook it's telling the story of your brand that's why they rolled out the timeline and up here studies are showing that people are taking a look at the timeline so go ahead and put those milestones when you opened your business when you made your first million whatever it is I'll put that up here um, and, and you will note that um, through posting and highlighting on your timeline. Now um, on your page you'll notice that you have this um, look who's talking button um, Doreen from Warren Media has named it that but um, the default is highlights but you'll also see friend activity your friends that are posting on the page um, posts by your brand and then posts by your fans okay that's what that's about um, and then every time um, this is the case you have friend activity how many friends are attached to the page that you visit so as an admin, you're seeing exactly what other people's uh, other people will see, um, and then a post by a friend. This makes um, any user that comes to your page they will feel more personalized experience from that. And then right below you have recent posts on the page in this square here, um, and then below that if you've managed to. Um, combine place and page here, you can collect recommendations. You'll see that here on the page and then you go down to the likes of the brand or the page. Um, so when you are interacting as your brand on Facebook and you like another page as your brand, that's what shows up here. So people can see what you're up to, what you like, and so forth. Now, um, let's hop to a business that has um, really gone um, and done some neat things with their graphics. They've got the banner 851 across, 315 down, and it, it shows people using their product, using their facility, and this logo um, reaffirms their brand. Now only 2% of people will ever come back to your page, but for that first time visitor, um, they've really done well with their brand. They want to get their clickable website in here, but um, they've got opt into the email list. That's a good place to put that here. Um, videos are available. Become a member uh, or you know maybe just say welcome. Um, these are very well placed and you want to make sure that you've thoroughly looked at the information and, and that you know what's on your tabs. Now let's say you want to switch places with a tab. Um, it's very easy. Shazam! That like has changed but um, you, that's not anything that you really need to have um, up here so because you you see likes are here up above or below the business name you don't need that there so um, let's say you don't have strong graphics but you have a brand that um, people just love you can put an image here um, this is community members using and, and celebrating the brand they've got that logo that follows them around Facebook you can see right here that's what you see when you post that follows you okay and um, they are working on ordering online so we've got a nice luscious piece of pizza here um, for people to click on and order and um, they've done a good job with with um, their business let's hop to another one um, one hour floor plans actually services real estate professionals they provide 3d floor plans for um, real estate agents and um, they put their product up in this banner and you can change this every day every week every month every year but that's what they've started they've decided to do and they have started with the uh, start your free trial here that's very important to them you can actually use the software for free on their Facebook page and um, that's what they've done there so um, that's a brief look at um, your Facebook to get your admin panel you go up to the top right here click admin panel and it'll give you a brief rundown of what's happening on your page. So I'm Carrie with Idea Girl Media. I hope I've given you some um, helpful insight for your Facebook page as a page owner or an admin. And take care. I'll see you here on Facebook.